New at 10, we continue our courageous conversation tonight on what self-help looks like now. Color 10's Bria Douglas shows us now how some people in Springfield are using painting as more than just artistic expression. Bria. David and Heather, I went to an art class at Painting with the Twist on South Campbell, and the people there tell me the craft is also therapeutic. It's a Sunday afternoon at this art class where the theme is Paint Your Pet combined painting a man's best friend while sipping on a little wine and what more can you ask for? We're pretty crazy about our dogs. <laughs> um, so people aren't really surprised when they come over to our house and they see a huge canvas of our other dogs. So they they always are like, where's Molly? Why didn't you paint Molly? So Carly Townsend is finally painting her beloved Molly. We adopted her a year ago in Colorado from a shelter. Painting is more than just a hobby for Townsend, it helps her deal with her emotional issues. I have struggled with mental illness for a long time and um, painting has always just helped um, throughout the process. Art therapy is, you know, a real thing and um, I think the more we talk about, you know, how we cope with our mental illness, the less of a stigma there'll be. For Townsend, the simple stroke of a brush takes her mind off the internal battles that wage within. It gives me something else to focus on um, and then once it's done, I have something to, again, still focus on and look at and be reminded of, you know, good energy and good company. I actually came with some friends today and just um, kind of a girl's day out. For Emily Mertensmeyer, painting is less about therapy and more about just having a good time. I just really enjoy um, spending time with friends and other people. I'm a stay-at-home mom, so just getting out and enjoying adults. I like what you're doing with this by flaring it up. Mm -hmm. Just keep kind of flaring it up and lighten it up as you get a little bit further up. In my classes, if they haven't enjoyed themselves, then I failed. I want them to relax and have a good time. O.T. Brewer has been teaching art at Painting with a Twist for two and a half years. During his time there, he's seen how painting can get his students through life-changing moments. If there's just one person, we don't do a class. At, but she said she really wanted to do it because she was going under a lot of stress. She was getting ready to do chemotherapy and for the next day. So I did the class with her, and she later on uh, sent us an email saying that was the best therapy that she's ever had. In her life. A little wine, a little artwork, and when it's all said and done, a sense of accomplishment. I feel a lot of pride. I know it's probably cliche, but um, when I finally finish something and um, take it home. I feel like it will be good, um, and I'll be excited about it. And throughout the rest of the week, Painting with a Twist will be offering, yes, it's that time of year, Christmas-themed classes. Already that time. Bria Douglas.